usually uh, in a situation like that, if you if you know the animal's disposition and know his behavior, you can usually go up with a sock and put over his head and lead him anywhere. But this in here seems to be kind of feral and uh, can't get close to it. So probably what we're going to have to do is use chemical capture and see if we can get it up that way. Used to, they they used them for uh, you know the food. Actually, and of course, I've never I've never tasted one. I've never had the pleasure of, of you know having to eat one. But I've heard it tastes like steak. But uh, I know nothing about them that much. I really don't know their behavior. Uh, something you don't run in that often. Most people that's got emus pretty well keep them up. It's just something you don't see every day. Uh, but we will uh, do whatever it takes to get up. We don't want to get out and run hurt someone. Actually, this, this is probably my second one. Uh, we darted one several years ago, probably about 10 years ago, up on 27, and unfortunately it died. But, uh, uh, also, you know, you, you run into things like this. I mean, but it's just not an everyday occurrence. But uh, we'll see what we can do with this one. Well, we just leave them alone. 